Hey, it's your girl Nini, and welcome to or welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video is featuring one of my most important wig accessories. I'm going to be showing you guys what wig brush I use to help detangle my wigs, get them together when they're all matted up. I'm also going to be showing you how I use this brush and giving you the direct link to it in the description of this video underneath the title if you're interested. Along with that direct link, you can find the links to the hair that I'm wearing right now, my outfit, and my makeup there as well. I use this brush to give my wigs a really good detangle and it helps me to be able to maintain them over a long period of time. I love it because it's really sturdy, it hasn't broken on me, and I've used it on some very serious wig situations, okay? <laughs> This is the Dry Bar Lemon Bar Paddle Brush, and this is the brush that I use as my wig brush. Here's a close-up on the brush. It's a bright yellow matte feel paddle brush. It has strong bristles, in my opinion. This brush is a pretty big size, in my opinion. I've had it for about a year and a half, close to a year and a half, and none of the bristles have broken on me. It's a very sturdy hard feeling brush and it's just been very helpful in maintaining my wigs especially my synthetic wigs i've also used this brush on my natural hair and you guys know my hair is pretty thick and long and it has been able to handle it too this brand also has a smaller version of this brush which i also have so i will put a link to it in the description underneath the link to this one if you guys are interested so now that i've shown you the product let's see it in action I'm gonna take one of my older synthetic wigs that I have worn many, many times. It's a good wig and I do wanna keep it because it's something that's simple and easy for me to style, but it's definitely in a rough shape. I'm gonna show you guys how tangled it is. I'm going to detangle it and style it with only this wig brush. Not gonna add any product besides what's already in there. And I'm gonna show you guys what this brush can do. So you guys, I'm going to go ahead and give my overall rating for this wig brush that I am showing you guys today. But first, I'm gonna tell you the pros and the cons of this brush, and then I'll give you my overall rating at the end of the video. So the pros of this wig brush is that it is very sturdy in my opinion. It's worked really well. None of the bristles have broken on me. Now it's not as challenging to clean as the blow dryer brush, but it does take a little bit of extra elbow grease, if you know what I mean, for me to clean this as opposed to some of my just other random brushes. I do have to make sure that I really get into the grooves of each of these bristles and make sure I get it clean, get any lint out of it and things like that. I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys my overall rating of this brush and I'm gonna rate this brush for wigs a 10 out of 10, y'all. I don't really have anything specifically really bad to say so far. So I am gonna give this a 10 out of 10 and this is you guys' time to sound off in the comments. Let me know what you're using as a wig brush and would you give this one a try? I love you guys so much. I wanna thank you guys so much for joining this video, watching it, and subscribing to my channel. If you're not subscribed, I hope you will consider subscribing, and I hope to see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Love you guys so much, and I'll talk to you later. Bye!